The Dragon Egg, one of the most sought after items in Minecraft. But being only able to obtain it once, you'd think the same would go for some PvP. A server with a 10 year old map, a small player base, but this isn't the case. I'm going to tell you why. To understand why this glitch came to light, we need to understand the history of the Dragon Egg on Sim PvP. Sometime in 2011, a player known as Rumpslim went to the End Dimension to fight the Ender Dragon. He came with another player that he met along the way, named Viper. Unfortunately, when they got into the End, Viper was knocked into the void immediately, leaving Rumpslim on his own. Thankfully, Rumpslim was able to collect some players who wanted to help including Mr. Strawman and Dakadok. Altogether, there was around 7 players who followed Rumpslin to the main end island as they fought off the dragon. Surprisingly, after defeating the Ender Dragon and sharing XP, everyone left the end dimension. Rumpslin was the only person who wanted the egg, and respectively, that's what he sought out to do. Getting close up to the egg, Rumpslin used a piston to retrieve it, being the first ever player on Sim PvP to obtain an egg. However, Rumpslim lived 16,000 blocks from spawn, leaving him vulnerable to griefers. He had the egg at his base for anyone to steal. Since he was living abroad he didn't have his computer with him, but he had borrowed his friend's computer just to store the dragon egg in his e-chest. Rumpslim would share his dragon egg with others so they could get the advancement, such as Ostrich1414. He did this by making a player set their spawn in front of him, as he dropped the dragon egg and as soon as they picked it up and got the advancement, Rumpslim would kill them so he could retrieve it back. During Sim PvP's lifetime, there would be two end resets. These occurred very early on in the server and were the reason why two more dragon eggs were collected by other players. These players would be Clipchip and Rev Stoningpot, with Clipchip still playing every now and then today. Rev Stoningpot would not possess his dragon egg forever though, as in 2018, he put it up for auction where Mr. Strawman would eventually buy it for around 50 USD. Today, these original eggs are privately held as rare trophy items, either on display or safely locked away in an under chest arguably making them some of the rarest items on Sim PvP. The dragon eggs we just talked about are what players call the organic eggs. As I've said, there only exists three dragon eggs on the server up until this point. As in 2019, Anthand and Egnaraki utilized a fabrication glitch which allowed them to successfully obtain a dragon egg. They were immediately questioned by the admins although they were eventually allowed to keep their egg on the condition that they did not share it, sell it, or give it to anyone else. Anthand and Egnaraki's possession of the server's first known artificial dragon egg sparked much controversy among the player base at the time, many of whom were angered by the prospect that such a rare item was being devalued through this glitch. Nevertheless, by 2019, there were four dragon eggs in circulation on Sim PvP. However, in early August 2020, whilst respawning and fighting the Ender Dragon, 72 Worlds and Pano Skylar unintentionally discovered a glitch that allowed him to obtain a Dragon Egg. This new glitch was far more simple to perform than the one that Ant Hand and Egonarchy used, and would soon influence a wave of players to attempt to try and obtain one themselves. As 72 Worlds and Pano Skylar were awaiting word from the admins as to what they should do with their Dragon Egg, Bergam alone figured out the exploit and successfully glitched a Dragon Egg for himself. Soon after, more players began to do so. Ostrich1414 and Zephron both glitched in artificial dragon eggs, as did myself, 4Pilot and Skuller G, all within the span of about 3 days. Furthermore, the players obtaining these artificial dragon eggs were not only gaining the next generation advancement, but were allowing their friends or close players to hold the eggs as well, and obtain the advancement. Truly, a dragon egg crisis was in the mist. This sudden wave of dragon egg possession caused a massive controversy on the server. Many players were furious that the dragon egg once one of the rarest items on SubUP was now being immensely devalued and watered down to a common item. Many were nervous that aside from the known players who glitched the egg, there could be many, many more glitched eggs throughout the server, unknown to the public. This would greatly decrease their value and make them practically worthless. Of course, some players supported it, viewing the dragon eggs as a useless item and enjoying the prospect of being able to own one themselves without begging the original three owners to hold it. On August 9th, 2020, the admins announced that, quote, the exploitation and abuse of the dragon egg glitch is now considered duping and anyone caught using glitch to attain a dragon egg will be jailed for violating rule 2. This made the intentional glitching of the dragon eggs a jailable offence and immediately curtailed any new players from doing so. Later, on September 30th, players who own these glitched eggs were ordered to destroy them, preferably under admin supervision. Presuming that nobody kept any of their illegal eggs hidden, there once again remained just 4 dragon eggs in existence. 
I would like to thank Ostrich1414, Rumpslin, and Clipchip for providing me information for this video. If you like content like this, let me know by leaving a comment down below. Anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. See ya.